Well, in the period of plus or minus 20 years of what was Hannah Olin, I guess the, the thing one sees the most is our devotion to working in the heart of major cities. Uh, whether it's one, the largest city of the Intermountain West, Denver, or whether it's Los Angeles, whether it's New York City, London. One of the things is that we devoted our efforts and our time to produce projects that we felt would be transformative in some way and that would privilege a vision of civic life and public life and of the citizens coming out to be together and to be able to look around and see their city and where they were and be with each other. Projects that did that were projects that interested me the most. Whether they were mostly paved or mostly green didn't matter. It was the same project for me. And I also, because of the long devotion to the environment and my interest in natural process and, you know, the ocean and mountains and birds and animals and trees and stuff. Because of that, I had this sense that somehow getting nature into the city in a way that, uh, that actually had to do with what Ken Frampton calls critical regionalism. The notion that the, each project had to somehow be grounded in its place so that you couldn't do that project just anywhere and you would only do that project there. That's that old idea of genius of the place, the genius loci. The notion that each place has a, a, a genius and, and that that's true in cities. So our work began to try and look at what would you do over a railroad yard in London that's different from what you'd do on a landfill on the Hudson River. That's what's, what do they have in common? What is similar and then what would be specific to that place? For instance, in Battery Park City, I saw that it was a chance to do a project that would help change how people in New York approach the island and the waterfront of the whole Isle of Manhattan, which I think it did. So in the period of Hannah Olin, I would say that our goal was to know, have a, to know where you are and be able to work within that culture in a way that's meaningful to the people there, that they will utilize the space and it will leverage other things in terms of their uh, local uh, civic vision of themselves.